Hello fellow engineers and welcome to, uh, where's the name? Oh yeah, you have to zoom in now. We've unlocked so many levels, we have to zoom in to find out the name of the game. Welcome to Freeways. Ignore that. So Freeways is a traffic management game where you get to design your own highway interchanges. And if you've been following my City Skylines and Jotopia series, you may think my highway design skills are a little bit questionable, uh, but I actually designed roads and highways for like over nine years in real life. And I like to think it's given me some advantage as I've been able to do some realistic designs. A bit like this one, or like this one, or like that. Oh wait, no, no, not that one, not that one. Or like this one, the turbine. I love this one. One of my favorite interchange layouts. Yeah, but we are still working around the level. Last time we did this one, which was honestly the bane of my life. The most difficult thing I've ever done. Uh, but according to the comments, I actually got a really good score. 228 is like pretty much the highest I've seen from what people said they got in the comments. So yeah, pat on the back, Matt. Well done. Yeah, but anyway, the next level is this one, number... 58? Oh, and it's just a four-way interchange circling a jigsaw piece. Okay, so if we click on these, you can see, ah, traffic wants to go different areas the most. Okay, so on here, when you click, the wider the arrow, that's basically where the traffic mainly wants to go. So they want to go to the right to purple, mainly. They want to go to blue, mainly. They want... Oh, it's, it goes in a circle. Oh, okay, so I think we can probably just do a roundabout. And as we've sort of learned, doing a roundabout as big as possible makes it cheaper because you're making these roads, which are two roads, longer. Look, for example, Example, I'll just show you very quickly this truck here as we draw can you see it's emptying maybe not as it's quite full of concrete but if we just do that you can see where I were about there so remember where that location was and we'll clear and we'll do a big roundabout connect these arms up and hopefully you can see that's a lot less concrete purely because these like two-way roads they're a lot shorter so you're using a lot less concrete overall uh, but yeah I don't want to do that for my design though let's clear this I mean I pretty much do but as we're doing we're doing a circle tree road around in that direction clockwise but if you look at these ins and out they cross over and so i think what we're gonna have to do we're gonna have to do like a bridge for either the in or the out so let's just do that first and then we'll connect that and then we'll do a bridge over the top oh that's really bad <laughs> That's going to cause some carnage. Oh, these are really bad. Okay, I might have to... <laughs> I might have to make my roundabout a little bit smaller. Just because if we watch these cars... Oh, that back end proper goes out. This orange one almost stopped. Maybe we want to do like bit more of like a diamond because that might make it easier to draw because now we can connect you up. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's any better. That one's definitely not any better. That might create a carnado. Let's watch this green car. Is it going to be okay at this corner? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that's really not good. That's, no, we got to fix that. What is going on? I can't draw today. If you've never seen this game before, there's no undo button either. So you've literally got to clear every single time. I'll tell you what, what if I draw these first? So we've got those in. Then if we want to go over, we can do that. Over that one. This one goes over there, over there. And then we can just like cut the corners, I think. So we can just go like blob and blob. And that's the network complete. Right then, let's press the stopwatch. And this will simulate a load of traffic. Oh, it's a little bit slow. It is a little bit slow. Ooh, 553. Three, though. I think that's not too bad. I mean, generally, if we're over like 300, we're pretty good. So let's go to the next level. All right, so this one just to the left. What have we got? Oh, we've got quite a lot of roads coming in. Oh dear. Right, where do these want to go? Oh, is it the same thing? Oh, it's the same thing. They all just want to go to the one next to them, but a little bit to everyone else as well. So we'll literally just do these arms. So you go up to there. You go over to there. You sort of weirdly just go around there and over to there. And then we can just connect up all the other ones doing our little bridges. So like that. And then as before, we just connect up all the insides. Or do we? I'm sort of thinking this is like the main runs done. Can you see they're not flashing anymore? The thick arrows? Only the thin ones are flashing. What if... Oh, this could work. What if we put a roundabout in the middle for that traffic, if that makes sense? So if we were to... I mean, it's not quite going to be a roundabout. It's going to be like... Or whatever that is about. <laughs> yeah, but then we can just take all of our arms off. And we can say, you go on. And then you go off. Although ideally, oh, that's a little bit silly. Ideally, we want the on 
after. Or do we? I don't know if it makes a difference, actually. Don't know what would be best. That is not ideal, though. Look at those motorbikes. I really cocked that up. That's going to ruin me, that is. I can tell. I'll tell you what, I'll alternate. So I'll do on there and then off there. Network complete. So we got like a double roundabout thing going on. Let's simulate and see how we get on. Oh, it's looking quite good, actually. Oh, 579. I'll tell you what. That's pretty decent. I feel like I could have drawn this like a lot neater. And maybe I've avoided that bike issue. Uh, maybe we could have hit 600 on that one. Banging. Right. Next level. Okay, there's a lot going on here. Oh, God. <laughs> After a little bit of a click around, they all sort of want to go to each other fairly equally. Yeah, but the question is, where is everything? These two, like the pink and the blue, they sort of look like a UK plug socket. But if they had two grounding prongs, like I can imagine in the future, to get it extra safe, you ground twice. <laughs> Uh, we got roads around the bottom. We got the BFW, the big freaking willy. Uh, and then in the middle, we've got a load of lollipops. I assume we sort of want to... Do we want to go around those? I feel like we want a roundabout. And then maybe like a crisscross in the middle. That's got to be there for a reason. All right, I tell you what, I'm going to put straight throughs in first. So you're literally just going to go all the way over there. You're going to do the same, but go that way. And then do we want a roundabout around... I guess so. Let's let's try it out. Let's see what happens. So if they come out there, we probably want to go this way. Okay. And then we connect all of these arms. So you go over to there. You go over there. I feel like I've made a tortoise. Or is it like a bear? It actually looks like a bear, actually. And then adding these up, I guess I just want to go like that. All right, let's see how that goes. Where's the thing? There is. So, so, oh, there's a lot of traffic. Okay, that's not ideal. Oh, look, we've got to get 300 for a photo. I love a photo. Right, okay, to make this a little bit better, I assume we need to, like, crisscross more. We want to, like, bypass the roundabout if we can. So perhaps this middle one, we could go up to there. And same coming down. I could, of course, bridge over some of these crossroads, actually. That might be worth doing. But I just wanted to give people options. So what if we just do that? Has that made it any better? I think 154 four we're on. Oh, 271. We are getting closer. Okay, that was good. So what are the longest journeys? Let's say you're coming from this 98 east. If you want to get down to 64 east, currently have to go ooh, all the way around. So if we could do some kind of shortcut, we could go down there. And I might keep it at grade because then people coming out the blue plug, they should go across down and they'll be able to connect onto this. So like that, it really looks like a weird freaky bear now, actually. Oh, it is, it is clogging over this side. 281, that's not a lot better. This side was really clogged. I don't know, is there a better way of doing this? Actually, could this side be clogged? Because if we, if we do like the opposite of what we just did. So if we're going from 64 west, for example, if we want to get onto 98 west, they've got to go all the way around. And the same to get to the pink plug. So perhaps we want to go up there, around to there. Now it's like completely symmetrical. We've given the bear cheeks. <laughs> bear cheeks. Right, so let's simulate that. Yeah, the right is a lot less clogged. It still is clogged though. Oh, 314. We got the photo. This is what I love about this game. The reward. The reward is a photo of a real interchange. Oh, that's LA. There's a lot of roads going on there, actually. A lot of roadage. That'd be very nice. If you ever wondered, like, why do people do this? Why don't they just use roundabouts? Roundabouts are the best. Uh, things like this, they're basically designed so that you can, like, keep your speed everywhere. So all these curves are nice and smooth, which means you can go 70 miles an hour or whatever your local motorway national speed limit is. So you don't have to slow down. You can go any direction from any direction without slowing down. So very useful, but only if you've got the space. Generally in the UK, we always go to, like, a roundabout or something off a of motorway because uh, we're not blessed for space. All right, next up, level 61. Oh, we've got the sea. There's a UFO crashed in the sea. Bloody hell. Uh, and what's the traffic situation here? Hmm, okay. So there's a definite need to prioritize something. So I think this one, we might want to do like a straight up line to green and we'll try and figure out what we're going to do on the way. So we got that sorted. They then want to go to blue. So we could do an arm off. And then they also want to go to pink. So we could do an arm off. Yeah, but let's just see what other things we need to do first. So this one, they very much want to go to pink and a little bit to orange. So I think we'll put this road in. So that's that done. And then we'll do a bridge over like that. And actually, before we finish that bridge, I think this one is 
We're going to want like a three lane road. So I think we'll make that go even further just to give us space. And then we'll go down there. And then this one, they want to go ooh, to green as well. Okay, that's quite easy. I think basically we just want to go under this bridge that we made for ourselves. Stick along this edge, go into there. And then as well, do up to there. So that's all done. They just want to get to the red okay and finally this one they want to go over that way but also up there i think it might be worth if i have the space going over to there and then going down into that and then i think what i want to do these green ones i think i want to take them off like there I'll do a bridge over oh no it just connected oh i think it just connected i was gonna do that oh no look now the pinks are going that yeah i've cocked it Oh, why isn't there an undo button? Why? All right, there we go. I think I've done it right this time. So we'll go along there, up to there, and then we'll just do an arm off there and connect that in. So that's all of those ones done. We've just got to do the others. So I think before, didn't I? So these want to get to green. I'll tell you what, I might do a bridge over that, connect that in. And then they want to go to green, but quite a lot. They also want to go over to red. So what I might do... Oh, I can almost... I can feel what I should have done. I should have moved this green road up a little bit. Just so I could, like, connect into that bridge. Oh, well, I think we can get away with, like, that. So that's everything except for coming from 20 north. So can I... This is going to be risky as well. Can I come down there to a bridge over that? And then a bridge over to about there? I think we're connected. I don't know how good it is. Let's watch this purple car. Oh, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. We might have actually done this. And the final one, we just got to get them to blue. I mean, perhaps we could just come down and go in there. Oh, there's really not a lot of room. Alternatively, as it's not a lot of traffic, we could come off there and just connect under that bridge. That could work. Let's see what happens. Simulate. It's not the most smooth thing you've ever seen, but it's not that bad. 460. I think that's all right. I think that's all right. Oh, look, our overall world efficiency, 25,000. I have no idea if that's good or not. Now, we've still got a lot of levels to go, though. And I think these next few, they're all going to be coastal ones. So let's see what this one's like. Oh, God. These people have bought houses right on the shoreline, right next to a broken sunglasses shop as well. Very unusual. Right, so... Oh, they really want to go to Duck Road. Look how wide that arrow is. <laughs> It's just a triangle, it's so wide. It's like a chode of arrows. Oh, and they really want to go to green. Okay, they only want to go to those. Interesting, right. I sort of feel like I should put what I know in. So they definitely want to go down there. Oh, I went to the wrong one. <laughs> right, great start. So let's actually go to the right arrow. Good. And they also want to go over there. Okay, i tell you what, I'm going to put this road in. So that's that one done. We're going to do an in and an out of the sunglass shop. And it's sunglass, not sunglasses, because there's only one bit of glass. That one's broken. Uh, they want to go to green. So it's probably best to do that before. We might want to do that in a bridge. Or shall we just... Nah, sod it. We'll just go straight down. So that goes down into there. And then they just want to get to purple, which should be quite an easy fix. Because if we come off there to a bridge and hopefully we can squeeze through that gap oh, breathe in okay so next up we got to get over to there so i'm going to take this one down and then up and over in a bridge and then go along there and then i'm going to figure out where we want to go so they don't want to go to the sunglass shop that's good and we just got to connect to red and green uh, which is pretty straightforward i think because we essentially just do a bridge over that connect that in we can loop that over up to there and we can loop down onto that so everything's done apart from horse road. They want to get to blue. So how we do that is we come off there. This is going to be quite, oh God, a long bridge down to there. Network complete. Okay, let's simulate this. I didn't draw this the best in the end, but uh, we'll see what happens. Oh, traffic is very smooth. Not seeing any holdups. Six, two, five, back of the net. That is up there with one of my better scores. Right, I'm feeling the coastline. What's the next coast? Ooh, ooh, this is an easy one, is it? So they just want to go to there. They just want to go to there. They just want to go to there. Nice. Possibly the easiest map we've ever done. Although, although, let's do a test. Let's do a test. What I was talking about earlier with these arms, because this is essentially a roundabout. So if we do how most people would do it, which I guess is probably something like that. It's a roundabout there. So arm off. I'm on, off and on. So that's done. Let's simulate this. You can see traffic, pretty good. Not holding up at all, really. And the score, 310. So note the concrete used. 
3080. Traffic flow, 95. They're the ones we want to see if we can change. So if we clear this and we do this sort of thing. So the circular tree is a lot bigger, but all these arms are a lot shorter. The question is, is that better? So simulate. Oh, it's worse. It's way worse. Why is it worse? We've used way less concrete. Ah, oh, traffic float. Hang on. Ah, oh, look. It's this one. Can you see that arm? This blue car. I didn't draw it very well. Hang on. So that is the downside. You do need to draw things properly because you want smooth arms. Not like mine in real life. Mine are quite hairy. All right, there we go. Is that any better? 306. It's worse. How is the traffic flow worse? That is less concrete used than the original, but traffic flow is worse. Maybe I don't know anything about highway engineering. All right, what if we draw it this way? So we've got all those arms in nice and smooth. What if we now draw these arms in to make it a circular tree? All right, let's try that. That's got to be better. Look how fast they're going. Look how smooth it is. There it is, 327. Traffic flow way higher, 98. We didn't actually save that much concrete, but we did save some. Uh, 327, though, I think we'll take that. I don't know if you could get that much higher, if I'm honest. And then top left. Oh, oh. <laughs> what are we going to do here? North road to north road. Do we actually get points for this one? No, there's no stopwatch. So we don't get points, which means you can draw really efficient designs. Okay, so the final C level, what is it? Oh, double J's. So the JJ's just want to go to North Road and North Road wants to go to both. Okay, this should be pretty simple. Wait, is it? Yes, yes it is. Because we go down like that, we go through there and then back up. So we've made a nose. <laughs> we've made a nose. And then we come off there, go into that, off there, up to there, over to there, over to there. Now it's complete. Press the pink. Oh, it is like a weird nose. It's like being sniffed up, sniffing cars. 156, we got a photo. Your interchange here. Send a screenshot of your best interchange design of any level to envirobear2010 at gmail.com for a chance to be featured in this spot. All right, we've got to pick my best design. I think it's this one. Let's snap this out and let's send that to envirobear. <laughs> Right, so next episode, we'll definitely see that over there because that's definitely still a thing. Despite the email having 2010 in it, I'm sure he still looks at it. He's still trying to pick the winner. But anyway, guys, that was Three Ways. Cheers for joining. Peace, love, and tortoise-faced teddy bears. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.